you guys, have, oh, real quick, is we'll come over here. So what I mentioned with uh, uh, fabric material is you find that you need that you don't need that much uh, top exhaust, but what you need is more of a draw on the cutting table. So if you see these tabs here and here, you can actually lift these up and damper damper the that material. Or not that material, but the, the exhaust. Um, when, if you're dealing with say small pieces of material, you're not going to maximize the downdraft of having the entire honeycomb exposed. Uh, what I recommend doing is either have some sort of like plates that you can tile and lay over the top of it. Um, that's great for something that's reusable. Just make sure that uh, they're not going to scorch or anything like that when if it's in a cut pack. Uh, the other thing is, is what, what I recommend doing, there's a little bit of a waste to it, is you can go to like Home Depot or Lowe's and buy a big roll of like brown painters like paper or whatever. It's where you would throw it down on the ground. And what you can do is typically it'll come in like in a two foot roll. So you just bring it out, cut it to, uh, to, to size, and then just use masking tape and tape it to the cutting table. And then from there you'll have a box. So say that's a, what, a eight inch square. So what you'll do is you'll cut like either a seven and three quarters or an eight inch square out, and you'll end up just peeling that, pulling that, that portion out, then you can lay your material right into that open cavity, and you'll maximize the draw of the, of the, the down dot tape. And if you're only dealing with small portions of stuff, and say you're on this side of the table, or on that side of the table, and you want to uh, increase the uh, upper exhaust flow, but you still want that draw, you could close either one of these on this side. So okay. not necessarily down below, I and mean, you can always put that magnet material in there, but if you close up at least the top portion, that'll also help control some of your exhaust. Okay. Uh, the other thing too is um, you do have two exhaust ports. So obviously one's on the left side, one's on the right side. You can see where they're divided there. Uh, if you're cutting something solely on the left-hand side and you realize that you actually don't need draw of sorts on the, the right-hand side of the table, then just damper down, close down one of those, those uh, blast gates, and then you're, you're maximizing that draw on one side of the table. Do you guys have any questions regarding the cutting table at all?